in the following examples. Ulf Hamster, Fire Chief at the Professional Fire Brigade in Braunschweig, will present the technology behind a thermal imaging camera, its field of application and its limitations. Ulf Hamster is a trainer in the area of firefighting. He runs training courses on thermal imaging cameras, real-life firefighting and emergency rescue with breathing protection. There are three clear advantages of a thermal imaging camera. Thermal imaging cameras help save lives. Missing persons can be found and rescued faster in thick smoke. Hazards for firefighters can be determined early on, and the fire brigade can work quickly and efficiently. Thermal imaging cameras help prevent damage. Water damage or long hours on site come to mind here. A thermal imaging camera is an essential tool for the fire attack team during indoor operations. A thermal imaging camera that is kept in the safe is useless. Thermal imaging cameras detect the heat radiation an object emits. Its intensity is shown on a display, usually as a grayscale image. This means that the warmer an object, the brighter the thermal image appears. The quality of the image is not affected by darkness or smoke. You can literally see through smoke. All thermal imaging cameras have these properties, but they differ in size, image quality and operability. The Draeger UCF cameras can be operated easily and reliably with just one hand, even if that hand is gloved. The other hand remains free. The thermal imaging camera is perfect for indoor operations. The fire approach team can use it for orientation and safety in thick smoke. We know that every second counts when people are exposed to smoke from a fire inside a burning building. We set fire to a room in the training house you can see in the background. Visibility was extremely reduced and orientation and mobility technically difficult and time consuming. Time that a person trapped in this situation doesn't have. The thermal imaging camera changes all that. Room layout and furniture are suddenly clearly visible. Potential danger can be assessed quickly. The Draeger UCF camera has a useful new function with which the camera image can be frozen and shown to a team member. Using a thermal imaging camera, missing persons can be found and rescued quickly. Several studies show, and you've seen this yourselves, that the time until people are found and rescued is significantly shorter. This saves lives. It's often difficult to find the source of a fire. Visibility is poor due to the smoke or the fire is inside a crawl space. With the thermal imaging camera, the fire source or the heat it radiates can be determined accurately and much faster. Water from the fire hose can be aimed directly at the target with minimum damage and maximum success.
Mit dem integrierten Laser der neuen The camera operator can use the integrated laser of the new Draeger UCF camera to mark the warm spots as if pointing with his finger. The search for disoriented persons or accident victims in shock takes considerable staff resources and is a race against time, particularly at night or during bad weather. Thermal imaging cameras are a big help, particularly in cooler temperatures. The outlines of persons are clearly visible and quick success is guaranteed. The automatic brightness adjustment of the Draeger UCF cameras ensures optimal readability of the display. The thermal imaging camera provides the operations commander and his team with important information. Even though it's not possible to look inside containers, the fill level can be read at the container wall and the spread on the ground can be tracked. The leakage of neutral liquids is clearly visible on a wet road surface and the appropriate measures can be taken. But be careful, make sure X protection is guaranteed when selecting operational resources for an incident in a hazardous area. The Draeger UCF 7000 and 9000 can be used in explosive atmospheres of Zone 1. When choosing a thermal imaging camera, image quality is not the only important aspect. The requirements for a thermal imaging camera to be used by rescue services are particularly demanding and ask for a high-quality, robust product. Only high-quality material will hold up in the situations depicted here. Before Draeger cameras can be put on the market, they're subjected to a series of challenging tests during the development phase. We know that only the best products can withstand the extreme conditions of the day-to-day -day work of firefighters and rescue forces without damage over a longer period of time. This is why Draeger develops its thermal imaging camera according to strict NFPA directives. For the drop test, a thermal imaging camera is placed on a 2-meter high platform. The camera must be set to the on mode, that is, switched on. It is now dropped on a steel plate 8 consecutive times. The evaluation follows. The camera has passed the test. The camera is switched on and placed inside this steel drum with a diameter of 120 centimeters. The drum starts turning at a speed of 15 rotations per minute. The test takes 30 minutes. The camera has passed the test if it still works properly after this time.
The camera is attached to a sled, switched on and preconditioned at 95 degrees Celsius for 15 minutes. Then the sled is moved in front of the burners of the test setup. Now the flame is applied to the camera for 10 seconds at about 1000 degrees Celsius. The camera has also passed the equivalent NFPA test requirements. The proof? The camera is still fully functional. The images of the thermal imaging camera are based on the heat radiation of objects, but sometimes we can be fooled by physics. Reflective surfaces made of metal, glass or tile can falsify the thermal image. Comprehensive training is required to interpret these images correctly. The thermal imaging camera is the tool that allows us to work quickly and effectively. But it's important that certain standards are met. This means group work with a secured retreat route, water in the pipe in case of danger, radio communication with the scene, and a working emergency crew plan, including the suitable means of mobility for the situation, for example, crab crawl. All this is important to guarantee safe working conditions and the long-term success of our operations. Knowing what the thermal imaging camera can do and using it to its full potential tremendously increases efficiency and safety of a fire brigade. The purchase also makes sense economically. According to a 2005 study of the insurance group Physischungskammer Bayern, the use of a thermal imaging camera reduces costs of fire incident damage by approximately 8,000 euros. From a societal viewpoint, a thermal imaging camera, depending on the purchase price, may already pay off after the first incident.